It's party time! Welcome to picturesque Piñata Island. In its many gardens, all manner of piñatas live, dance, and dream that one day they will be chosen to entertain at a party as only piñatas can. Well, most piñatas, that is. Oh, fudge! Shake it, shake it, shake it, like a party animal. Break it, break it, break it, like a party animal. Shake it, shake it, shake it, like a party animal. Break it, break it, break it, break it, like a party animal. Save up the piñata, What's going on everybody, it's TDB, and I've decided to switch up my usual type of games, which is going to be like the, my first person shooters and stuff like that, with a little bit of a different game here today. Today we're going to be uh, kind of leaning back a little bit. We're going to be a more peaceful type of game with Viva Pinata. Uh, I used to play this game a lot when I was a kid. Um, I mean, it, it, it honestly... It's in that peaceful game category that a lot of people just kind of need to take a break and just be calm and peaceful for once. So that's what we're going to be starting a little, maybe a little series on, um, something like that. So let's get right into this. We're going to enter our new garden. What's up? Oh, she doesn't seem happy. Oh, hello. I was hoping someone would come and help me tidy up this mess. You must be the new owner. Yeah. I'm Lefos, and I'm Lefos, here to help okay. you. Okay. Oh, it's a book. A journal, okay. I've given you the journal. When you finish talking to me, press X to open the menu, and then I'll tell you what to try next. Okay. The journal, okay. This is the journal. It stores all the information that you discover when you are playing the game. The journal okay, is breaking split the fourth wall. <laughs> different parts to make it easier to find what you need. It works just like the menu. There's not much to see yet, so have a quick look and let's get back to the garden. Got our encyclopedia characters, family members. Of course, Lefos is going to be the only one at the moment, but I think that's nice. There's your first alert. Whenever something important is happening, this is how you'll be told. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I, I can see that. When you are ready, Press down on the D-pad to select the alert. Mm -mm. I, I, <laughs> Alerts will wait down here for you to look at them. If something is very important, the alert will open automatically. If you have okay. time for another present, it's something you can't manage without. Oh. Yo! We got a shovel! <laughs> It, it's a little, little beat up, but it's a starter. Okay, grab your shovel from the menu and turn this mess into your dream garden. Put the cursor on me and press A for help. It's a good thing I've played the game before, so I know what we gotta do. The yes, I know. All right, so let's start by kind of breaking up some of the stuff that's in our little boundary we have so far. Man, whoever has garden before really did not want to clean it up after leaving. Yeah, I know. I'm working on it. You just gotta give me a second. 
Oh, it's a whirler. He's so happy. Well done. You attracted a worm. The worm, worm has turned up because you have uncovered some good soil. Okay. Is that what I think it is? Yep, <laughs> the Banjo Kazooie. Thank you. I love, I love that they always in Viva Pinata they always give hints to like some of their other games rares made in the past. Might have to do a little Throwback Thursday episodes on uh, Banjo Kazooie maybe. That'd be pretty cool. Cause I've been thinking about starting that as like a new series like every I don't know if we'd be able to do it every Thursday but maybe like every week we'll do a throwback episode on something that like maybe a game that everybody's kind of played in the past like as their childhood game or something would be kind of cool I know um, Banjo-Kazooie is definitely good on that list Burnout 3 Takedown is definitely a personal one of mine that I would love to do for that series, but who knows? Maybe maybe we, maybe we might do that soon. I know um, I haven't really been uploading a whole lot recently. It's also because I uh, have just kind of... I've started working at Best Buy, you know? Um, that's, been, that's been really fun so far. Definitely been a very interesting experience, though, for sure being able to like work retail and stuff like that has been pretty cool um and just being able to like help people find technology or stuff they haven't ever seen before at best buy has been really cool so um and of course i i just finished up community college so upload should be coming back to more like once a week or maybe twice a week depending if i have some time so that'd be pretty cool for you guys to be able to watch some stuff Hopefully we can put some new stuff out there that y'all will enjoy. Like I said, though, Viva Pinata was is definitely a game that I, I remember playing as a kid on the 360. Of course, that's what we're playing it on now is the 360. Um, but it was, it's honestly, like I said in the beginning, it's just, just peaceful. And you know, a lot of a lot of the time, we just need something peaceful in our lives. So. I thought, why not make a little series away from Halo and Gmod and stuff like that? And do just Viva Pinata. Just have something for people to like relax to and listen to me talk about random things, I guess, while we work on our garden. So, as we're finishing up that, there we go. Oh, well, there's just a little bit there. So now we have our nice little area down there and now we can start the yes grass? I know now we can start pouring some grass okay oh oh look it's a worm oh the serpent we've attracted the serpent it's just a little slithery fella Look, he's, he's dancing. You are doing. I guess he likes our grass that I, I started putting in. Oh, we got two in the garden. Oh. Did you see the color change? The worm has become a resident. Oh. It likes your garden so much, it's going to stay here. Hmm. Try naming your new resident. Just close this alert with A, put away any tool you have open, and place the cursor over your worm. It became a resident of our little little garden we've made here already. That's cool. He just wants to chill with us. That's cool. Fine by me. Maybe maybe we can build him a little house later on or something. Sparrowman. What's oh, a little bird? Little birdie guy. Come 
Congratulations! You've attracted a sparrow mint. Sparrow mints can hear a worm wiggling from miles away and will come to take a look. Interesting. A donut? Oh. Look at him go! He's just prancing through the... F Whoa! He looks so happy! Look! A donut has come to look at all of that lovely grass you've grown. It's pretty nice. We nice. We have a nice little grass going. You gonna you gonna come out? And, oh, he did. He. We got a new. We got another resident. Look at him. He's so happy. They're so happy. They just want to hang out. So that's cool. Let's rename him. What do we? What do we want to name this one? We'll we'll name it. Um. We're me too. No. Ah. Uh, We'll name this one Willy. Willy the Worm. Oh, oh. <laughs> well, what a coincidence. We just named a name the Worm Willy. And we get Willy the Builder. Oh, and he's giving us a free house? Okay. We'll place it right here for the worms. There's Willy! What's going on, Willy? He is, he's got a strut in his legs today. Oh, experiment. What do you need to do? After two were learns romance. That's his, that's the resident requirement? You just have to have them romance? Okay. Jeez, Willy. <laughs> Or shovel and just break it. Bonk. Oh, it's a little tube. Now that you've provided the worms with everything they need, the hearts above their heads show they are ready to romance. <laughs> romance? This worm is set. Okay, Willy and, and Wormy. Whoa. He's a contortionist. He looks so happy. Oh. Welcome to the romancing mini game. Okay, I know how, I remember how to play it. I gotta go over to the other worm. Sneak through. Oh. The coin. There we go. We got all the coins. You're not worming your way out of this one. <laughs> the little now puns. Now you've completed the game, your happy piñatas will go into their house and do a romance dance. A romance dance? Uh oh. That one's that one's just a little little late to the party. <laughs> Yo, he's breaking it down. Look at him go. They got the moves. Mm -hmm. Oh, Starkos. Mm -mm. The egg shed. <laughs> That's a. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> Your pinatas have made an egg. After pinatas have done the romance dance, a new baby pinata is brought to the garden, safely packed in a patterned egg. Interesting. So that's a new new way of romancing, I guess. 
Look, it's a it's the donut. Oh. Well, here she comes with the egg. Worry no more, your new egg has been delivered safely. Another successful mission for Storkos, the people's champion. <laughs> Every time in There's our egg. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's so small. Just a little guy. Oh. Oh, the spearman's becoming a resident now. It's, uh, they're always so happy. Oh, looks like they're all going to bed, except for the little guy. Oh, nope. They're coming back out. Wormy and Willy coming back out. Now that you have raised a baby worm, I feel like I can really trust you. I have two seeds that are ideal for someone starting a new garden. Ah, yes. Okay. Got two seeds. Um, you know what? We'll give, we'll give the newly added worms a nice plant. The next time you put... Well done. You planted your seed, That's but... the water, of course. Oh, we got a watering can. Once again, the could be a big carrot. It's gonna be the size of the the worms. Look at this thing grow! Holy crap! You seem to have most of the basics now. So see what you can do with the rest of the day before the sun goes down. You just try to romance enough. Okay. Oh, it's a bunny comb. Oh, it's be ah. We grew a carrot, so we get the the bunny. Is it like parents keep out? It does on the tree. Did a moth drop. They did come up with some very interesting names for the pinata animals, that's for sure. Well done! You attracted a moth drop. Oh, look at that. There was a way I could turn off the menu. Okay. Ah, oh, well, it's, it's already gone dark. Damn. Don't want to do this. Oh. Okay, we we leveled up. Twice. You've leveled up. Or once, I guess. You filled the petals around the clock, which means you've taken a step closer to becoming a truly great gardener. Okay. Okay. Now we're level two. Oh. Cedos. Mr. Seedman himself! Let me introduce Seedos. He's obsessed with gathering seeds. You should try talking to him. What? A hunt is I start. know. I didn't want this to happen. But it has to happen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh! Beat him up! Oh! Oh! Rest in peace, little worm! Oh, he just gets rebuilt outside, okay. That's nice. Oh. Sorry, other worm. Hello, I'm Cedos. Take a seed and don't hit me with your spade. 
Why would I? Well, give us another seed. Maybe if I keep talking to him. Give me more seeds. Oh, he's out. Okay, so we got these like little little ones we'll plant. Couple more seeds. Oh. Lottie. Oh. Hey everyone! You should all know my store's open again. I expect to see you in here very soon. Just bring lots of cash. <laughs> Nobody likes the taste of chocolate coins more than Lottie, I can tell you. Alright, so she likes money. The village now costs a lot. She likes her money, 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 money. Uh. Buzzle gum. Oh my. It's a little large bee. Oh, I didn't even... You could see the garden in that. Your garden has attracted a buzzle gum. They... Okay, so now we have a little buzzle gum. What is this one? Buttercup, buttercup. Is this also a buttercup? A daisy. Ah! Oh, and we, okay, so when we grow a new type of plant, we also get the levels for it, too. Okay. Let's go visit Costalon. Ah, if it isn't the new gardener in town, you're guaranteed a warm welcome at Costalot's store. Whether you're here to buy or sell, which will it... I, I'm just looking to buy, lady. Okay, so we got a we got a, a couple options. Fire burn, which is that light that we're probably gonna we're gonna purchase the light for sure. So that so that we can get the the moth drop. Um, we'll place it. We'll place it in the middle here, so that both houses get a nice little light going for them. Uh, right there. Looks like. And then, I think it said we can also buy seeds, so we can buy some more seeds. I knew extending the opening hours would pay off. Come in, come in. How much is it for fences? Six? Okay, we're gonna build a that nice little garden. In our garden. Uh, we'll build it... Right here. There's a nice little spot. Looks like I need... So, and then we'll go back to the store when we're time for some new seeds. If she's got any new seeds. Good Might morning. be just a little broke. Can I interest you in something seedy? Oh, no, I don't mean like that. Carrot, turnip, okay. So I think the turnips are going to probably be for the mouse. what you want. So we will get some of those then. Oh, barely enough. You. There we go. Okay, we have that over there. And then... If you could just come off of there so I could... Give us a nice... So I can have you guys... Romance, that'd be really nice. Seed off! If you like seeds, smile! Seeds... Give me more seeds, seed off. <laughs> You have any more? I nope, that's it. Okay. Whoa! Carrots are flying. Oh, white flutterscotch. Congratulations! You have attracted a white flutterscotch. Oh, come on, give me the seed. The seed. 
There we go. Finally. Let's see how. Oh, okay. Ready to get all the coins. There we go. I'm a peck of the punch, is that what it said? <laughs> oh, the, the, the bunny. Ow! Oh. Oh, we get to see, we get to see their romance dance. Whoa! Whoa! Oh! I don't know, I think the Worms one was a little bit cooler. Your gardening is a- oh, We leveled up again. Bring some of these carrots out so maybe we can get the bunny. Oh! We got the bunny! Let's go. Oh, uh oh. This guy doesn't look too too good. And he's already colored, so I think that means he's if I recall, he's the bad ones. Here comes trouble. A sour shelly bean has found your garden. No. They only want one thing. A seed feast. Seed feast, huh? And a raisin. Interesting. Uh, <laughs> it's fast! Meep, meep, meep. Here comes a raisin. A raisin. Oh, and we got a marshmallow. We're just getting everybody to come hang out in the garden. Okay, but I really, I really need to water these. I really need to water. Oh. Oh, we actually get a full working shovel. It's actually like not this rusty. Is progress, but it's very slow. Okay, I need to water these. There we go. Uh oh. Here comes trouble. Oh. Gretchen fetch him. Oh. Oh. Taking pictures. You there. Over here. I'm the hunter in this here village. If there's a piñata that needs fetching, just come find me. I okay. like piñatas, so the only ones I'll fetch for a gardener are ones I know they can handle. Ones that have resided before. We clear? Uh, yeah. She doesn't seem very nice. Nope. Oh. Fanny Franker. I would assume she's post office lady. Yoo-hoo! Pinata Island's magnificent postal services are at your disposal for all your needs. You know, passing stuff on, getting some goodies off other Xbox Live gardeners. <laughs> the the breath the breaking of the fourth wall is so funny. What do you want? Are you gonna come into here? Yep, we got the path lies resin. Okay. Are you gonna are you gonna come in here? Oh no! He's gonna eat the mouse! Oh and he's gonna come in here. One apple seed. I don't have an apple seed. Or in their egg hatch. We got so much going on. Hey. Get out of here. Don't be a bully. Uh oh. No! You bully! Oh. You're a bully.
Or me have some candy. I think that's what we're going to call it for today. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed me just kind of playing a little bit of Viva Pinata. Um, maybe we might make this a little series. Who knows? But like I said, I hope you guys all enjoyed. Um, other than that, 